Hello there Pisces, welcome to my channel. I am the Soul Teacher and I'm here today to do your new moon in Taurus readings. So new moon, as you know, is all about new cycles, new beginnings, new manifestations. The beauty of this one, however, is it's the new moon in Taurus. Taurus is an earth sign and it's happening today, the 11th of May. And the energy would be around for the next two weeks, which means that your manifestations have a really good possibility of grounding into reality within the next two weeks so this is this is really cool your overall energy for this is the great gathering it's all coming together intuitive hits soul tribe you are a very intuitive sign pisces being a water sign and all um, you're also the dreamer of the zodiac so it's very easy for you to get intuitive messages through your dreams and imagination so take heed of that um, so you are about to find your soul tribe, Pisces. That's very nice. That is very nice. So just a little bit of background about Taurus. Taurus is an earth sign, as I said. Um, Taurus is normally a very calm energy, but it that can be really stubborn at times and also quite aggressive when being threatened. So, um, well, also, Taurus is ruled by Venus. Venus is all about love and luxury, which is really cool. Who doesn't like that? And Taurus basks in everything beautiful. So, Pisces, let's see what Luna is bringing you today. The reading so far has been really, really exciting and beautiful. Some of them quite... Um, important energy <laughs> very important energy soul messages so yeah for you i almost feel like this is just going to be really cool because you're going to find your soul tribe you've been purging your life of situations and people the last few months Pisces that could not have been easy you really deserve finding your soul tribe and being with people that love you and that, that, that um, you love. So that's your advice. Let's see, Pisces. What new avenue is your soul directing you towards? Oh, wow. Your commitment is being tested. You've had this before, Pisces. Your commitment here that's being tested is your commitment to your soul. How committed are you to finding your, your true soul purpose, your true soul life path, and your soul tribe how committed are you gosh okay i thought this was going to be like a sliding feel energy and it's not okay so um what message is this new moon bringing you yeah have faith in your dreams everything you dream you can have pisces have faith in your dreams wow and you've been dreaming of of finding your soul tribe i know you have you, you must have it's like it's 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 an intuitive thing it's not something that you can even even though you try to suppress certain things and emotions this is not something that you would be able to stop your next step wow show the world the real you because you will never find your soul tribe if you don't show who you really are by showing the world the real you you will attract your soul tribe into your life. And this is why your commitment is being tested to your commitment towards you, towards yourself, towards your soul. Because you have to be committed towards your soul to be able to show the world who you really are. And when you show the world who you really are, that's when you will attract your soul tribe. This is a very, very straightforward reading, Pisces. Advice, guidance, balance. Thank you, angels, for bringing my life into balance. Because when you show the world who you really are and you attract your soul tribe, your life would, it, it would be like magic. It would suddenly fall into place and everything would balance out. Wow, that is absolutely gorgeous. This is not something that you're going to have to work on. The only thing that you need to do is you need to be commit, committed enough to your soul, Pisces. Wow, that's beautiful reading, Pisces. I'll see you on the flip side.